Thank heaven for small favors, right? You have got to be kidding me. Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. Today on the agenda is cooling down Goron Village. And there's no better way than going to the coolest village in the entire world. The weather's so nice, but I figures I'd get stuck with guard duty. Won't someone please give me a break? All right, I gotta talk to the elder. How you doing, guy? You need something? Ice. Ice, huh? Hmm, well, in a chilly place like this, you figure there'd be at least a little lying around. Luckily for you, though, we got a fine local product called Mega Ice. Take a look. The guy living right here makes the stuff. He can help you out. Just don't expect to get it for free. It'll probably cost you. It'll probably cost you, guy. I'm not your guy, buddy. I'm not your buddy, friend. Hey there, little guy. I'm not your guy, friend. I see you got yourself a passenger car now. It's fate, I tell you. What's that? You say you've had it for a while? Well, that's news to me. Think you can give me a lift to a cool, clear spring? Why? Why, you ask? Well, listen to this crazy story. You know how we sell Mega Ice here? Yeah, it's our village's major export. Well, a little while ago, an ice choo-choo fell in the water. And ever since, there's been a gooey film floating on the surface. If we made Mega Ice out of this water, our customers would never come back. So please, you just gotta take me to a lake or some other body of water. And it's got to be in a cold place, because you can't make ice without the cold. Well, you're going to take me, aren't you? Let's go. Thank you kindly. I owe you one, guy. Okay, I'll be waiting for you on the train. Oh, okay. Sure, why not? But first... Evidently, there's something here. Notice how they've got the ice here. The ice-generating torch. You got a big green rupee. It's worth a hundred rupees. Nice. Link is getting a lot of cash. Oh, great. Those ice choo-choos. The one he warned me about. Heh. <laughs> You're not gonna make anyone's water gooey anymore, bub. Well, better just get this over with. Are you ready to go, Link? Yeah. All right, let's be off then. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> okay, where do I go, though? I honestly wouldn't know where to go. Maybe here. Actually, yeah, now that I think about it, yeah, Wellspring Station, of course. But what better way, right? Great, now Beetle decides to show up. Well, it's too late now. I don't want to buy your stuff ever again. I guess as long as I don't make any sudden movements or sudden stops, it should be fine. I want to get this over with. He doesn't appear to be complaining about the speed. Just gotta avoid getting hit by the enemies. There you go. You're headless Nick now. And bodyless Nick too. Sucks to be you, doesn't it? Oh, there's an armor train. It's a good thing he's not looking at me. That'd be bad. In fact, maybe I should slow down just to make sure. Just to make extra sure we don't cross paths. That wouldn't be very... Duong. I'd better be careful. Oh, lovely! Now there's a dark train over there. And he's heading right this way. Well, I'd better hurry up then. To avoid specifically running into that one. If that's even possible. I might have to stop completely. Although, I don't even know if that's possible. If that's feasible. I don't have time to kill both of you, you just have to kill yourselves later. Oh boy. This could be trouble. Okay, I should be fine. Leave me alone. 
Nobody wants any. We don't want any. Uh-oh. Didn't even notice that one. Oh, great. As if this wasn't enough, now the dark train is on our tail. Man, so much adversity. I feel like Yoshikage Kira. Darn it. That's not good. And as if that's not enough, I doubt I'm going to be able to stop like this. Actually, I probably could. As soon as you stop, it resets their position. But the problem is, can I, can I afford to do that? I may have to... Sorry, we're going to have to make an abrupt stop. I don't think I can do this, actually. I may have to continue moving. Yeah, wait, yeah, go down. Go, go to the right. That dark train isn't going this way. It's going the other way, so we should be good as long as I quit panicking. There we go. Luckily, my hunch it was right. Dark trains couldn't care less about pursuing you. Fortunately, that means I gotta, I gotta take a detour. Hang tight real quick. Well, this is actually kind of a funny situation. I'm actually chasing the dark train. Isn't that just amusing? Yeah, who's in front now, buddy? <laughs> I better not shoot too many at him. Otherwise, he'll slow down and I might just ram into him. That wouldn't be very good now, would it? Still funny, though, you gotta admit. I don't know, for some reason I just find it amusing that I'm the one following the dark train. <laughs> hey, maybe I'll just purposely make make him blow up. Oh, hey, buddy. I don't want him to get too far ahead. Unfortunately for him, he can't turn around. Oh, whoops. Sorry about that, I guess I should have blown my horn. I forgot, when, the, when you see one with a question mark on it, you gotta blow the horn. Whoops. Oh well. At least he's still smiling, so as long as things don't get any progressively worse, it should be okay. It should be fine. I think the dark train is going very slightly faster than I am. Very unfortunate. I thought we'd get to keep this chase up, at least until I got to the next stop, but uh, apparently not. Hang tight again. Okay, we are here. Ooh, that looks like a nice place for Mega Ice over there. It reminds me of the Thinking Guy meme, actually. The dark train can't chase you if you're chasing it. I'm just saying. Also, I noticed that there are hookshot spots here. This might be a good opportunity for me to get something. Booyah! Is this a prime spot for making Mega Ice or what? Yep, this is it. I'm gonna start up the business right here, guy. A force gem? That's obviously not a Triforce piece. You got a force gem! The Snow Rail map has started glowing! Ooh, nice. So these force gems cause the, the rails to appear? This force gem has energized the rail map. Okay, it's time to make the Mega Ice. Sorry, but could you come back in a little bit? There are certain company secrets I don't run, reveal to the public. Oh, great. I'd hate to figure out how exactly you make that Mega Ice. I'm betting it's stuff you don't want the public to know about. Ooh. I didn't even notice that. It's a stamp station. And I, maybe I should, um, eventually honor that secret. Maybe I should actually honor his wishes eventually. Now let's see. 
Right. That ought to do it. Excellent. Well, uh, it's a little thin, but I'm sure we could make do. This is a stamp station. Would you like to stamp Nico's stamp book? Yeah. Why not? I haven't been doing this very much. Yeah, I should probably be in the center, right? It's a good thing to let you do it over and over again. There's some kind of magic stamp that allows you to just reverse it anytime you want. Sure thing, guy. I guess I'll just leave and never return. Go away and never return. Are you ready to leave? Yes. Let's go, Link. I don't know where I'm going to go, but... Maybe I'll just see where those rails go. This is I've done this. I don't want to risk them. I don't want to risk um, any unforeseen problems. Ooh, the Force Realm. That's pretty cool. It's a good thing that Armored Train, unlike the, the underwater one, doesn't seem to immediately notice me. Which is quite nice. It's a good thing this train can just turn 300... It just turned 180 degrees without any problem. I see. Hello, friend. I don't think so. Oh, you're, you're now you're running. That's why I thought you better run. You better freaking run. You want to die? Good day to die, isn't it? Oh, you thought I was talking about me? I'm talking about you, head headless Nick. I don't have to obey these signs now. I don't have any passenger breathing down my neck. Well, I didn't need it, but I guess it's always good to hoard hearts, right? Don't worry, I won't break any of them. I'll try not to. I won't break them, but they might. They tend to do that. Eh, yeah, why not? I may not have a customer, but I'll... I'll acknowledge that one. Just because. Huh. There seems to be a spirit gate. Very peculiar, right? It's a good thing I don't have any other business in that ice temple. Otherwise, I'd probably be miffed right now. By the fact that there's an armored train in it and all that. Thankfully, that is not the case. What even is down here? Ah, oh, that's interesting. I guess. Sure, I guess I'll go over there. Actually, I don't remember going there before. Unless it's a forest temple. It's probably the forest temple, isn't it? Really? I just shot it. Does it take more than one? Okay, these guys are kind of durable, aren't they? Ouch. Okay. Whoops. I underestimated them a bit. But everything should be well. As long as I don't do it again. Just double tap them. Double tap that mofo, you know what I mean? It's like with zombies, you gotta tap them twice just to make sure they're down. At least I think so. But now I can't afford to fast forward. At least in my usual. I can't afford to keep the frame rate unlocked when they appear. Because I don't think I can take them. I definitely don't think I can take them. I get the feeling, though, that there might be something here that I haven't been able to do before. I mean, you never know. There might be some kind of secret area that required an item that you get much later in the game. And then you come back. And then you access a part of the temple that you couldn't before. It's possible. I don't know if it's probable, but um, I guess we'll check. I have to do something while that mega ice is waiting, apparently. It's not like the guy is willing to just share company secrets. Well, there probably isn't much here, to be honest. Hello. Ow. I forgot they do that. 
<laughs> oh, right. They turn into goo, too. Yeah, that's complicated. There we go. I mean, it's not going to be so easy right here. <laughs> It'll be a little bit more involved, but... Eh. Screw it. Ah, cool. That's one that I didn't get to yet. Would you like to stamp Nico's stamp book? Yes. There we are. Good news, Nico. I'm finally doing it. I'm finally getting around to doing it. I was going to do it eventually. Probably. Well, at least that was something to do. It's probably the only thing I'm going to be able to do in this temple, if I'm being honest. I can't imagine there's anything else to do in here. Actually, let me check the map. Let me just make absolute certain. See if there's anything I may have overlooked. That's the right word. Overlooked. Nope, not, not a thing. Well, that's all I can do in this temple. I came all here, to, all this way to get Nico's stamp book stamped. I mean, that's a justification, right? As long as I came here for some kind of purpose, it should be good, right? So, I'm gonna go back to that Springwell station. Hang tight real quick. Good news! He made the Mega Ice. Hey guys, so about that slick little freight car you got, why not load it up with some of our fine local Mega Ice? How about it? The ladies go wild for it and I'll even cut you a special deal. How does 25 rubies sound to you? Let's see what happens if I try to haggle. Too steep. Excuse me! Did I just hear what I thought I did? Cheaper. Oh, I get it. You're sharp, pal. I like that, so I'll cut you a deal. How about just 25 rupees, then? Do we have a deal? Um... What? What's that? You're saying I didn't make it any cheaper. I guess you caught me there. Okay, you're putting the screws on me, so how about two, 10 rupees? That's a steal, I tell you. <laughs> I want to see if I can haggle him down. I, apparently you can. What? I wouldn't even cut a deal like that for my own grandma. The price is 10 rupees. We gonna do... We gonna do this? Nah. Sheesh, you really know how to twist a guy's flipper. Tell you what, this time the ice is free. Heck, I'll even load on the train for you. Yes, for free. Sheesh. Happy now? Now's a good time to let you know some things about handling the product. First, don't hit anything or let the train sway when the ice is loaded on. If you do, the ice will spill everywhere. Also, watch out for monster attacks. Second, you're carrying ice, pal, so it's naturally it's gonna melt, yeah? In nice, chilly places like this, you wouldn't have to worry about that. But once you travel to a warmer place, it'll start melting before long. Get to where you're going before all the ice runs out. If you don't, be prepared to say bye-bye to all the ice. Indeed. I just got him to get it to me for free. Oh, I'm such... I'm such a devilish businessman. Are you ready to leave? Let's go, Link! Oh, whoops. Oh, I'm gonna pay for that. Come on, pal. Hmm. Okay. This shouldn't be a problem. I get the feeling that dark train's gonna be gone by the time I get there. He's going the other way, it should be a problem, right? It shouldn't be. I gotta make sure that this train is actually going to the right as it usually does and that it's not planning to come back around towards me. Really? Really? Wait, I actually have a better idea. Wait, never mind. They can't turn around, so if I just go to the left and stay there, he'll, he'll run right past me. Okay, just stop. Stop right there. Okay, stop, stop, there we go. Okay. And then we just wait, play the waiting game. I'm an expert at the waiting game. I do it a lot. Oh no, a dark train is coming. Whatever shall we do? Fortunately, I'm parked exactly where he can't get to me. I'm so glad that I... <laughs> that I saw that one guy 
you've shown me how to do this. That's probably about as close as you ever want to get to a dark train. All right, let's get, let's park this up. Let's back this up. Oh wait, I should probably follow behind the dark train. Cause like I said, the dark train can't follow you if you're following the dark train. It's troll logic, I know, but hey, it works. And as long as we're in this realm, the, the ice won't start melting yet. So it should be fine. I see Beetle's finally nearby. Let's see if I can get his attention. Hey, Beetle! You wanna acknowledge me finally? I got over 2,000 rupees burning a hole in my pocket. Come on, man. Hook me up. Hook me up, man. Hook me up. Luckily, he's right in my path, too. Whoops. <laughs> I got a little hasty. There we go. Come on, Beetle, what do you say? Hook me up? Oh, he doesn't really have much, does he? There's a heart, there's a heart container on his shelf, but I can't even get it. Hey, buddy. Oh, valued customer, we have everything you need at Beetle's Air Shop. Sure. Restores up to six hearts. Oh, so sorry, you can't buy any more of those. Fine, whatever, man. That'll be a hundred rupees for these ten bombs. Sure. Thank you. Can I interest you in anything else? Well, I'm not gonna buy tr buy this random assorted stuff. Oh, I see you haven't joined Beetle's membership club. It's just a hundred rupees. Sure, why not? I got a lot of rupees. Please continue shopping at Beetle's Air Shop. I'll be sending you a club card in the mail, so look out for it. The more you buy, the more points you earn, and the more points means no rewards. No other shop offers such luxurious rewards, you know. There better not be a dark train right in my face because of this. That would be so messed up. Really? There's a dark train in my freaking face. There's a dark train in my freaking face. Uh-oh. And, uh, I decided not to speed up because... Why would we want to do that? I mean, you know, dying is so much more interesting, isn't it? There you go. It may not do much good when you're backing away from one, but I'm going full speed ahead forward, so... I mean, I should be able to easily stun it and get ahead of it. If I can hit it consistently. Okay, there we go. I think that did it. Oh, whatever. What do I care? Really? It's actually following me now. That thing is actually following me now. Oh, there we go. That's how you stun it. That's how you can tell, because its wheels are lifted up, and it goes slower. It doesn't stop, but it, it does go slower. It should help. Now that it matters, I'll be going into the next realm in about a second anyway. And it's going that way anyway. Like I said, these things really don't they really don't care about pursuing you, and that's the that's the one thing I am appreciative of. Oh lovely, there's one that's parked itself right in the middle. And it, it refuses to move. That's just beautiful. That's just grand, isn't it? The ice is gonna start melting. Yep, it's already starting to melt. I gotta take a detour. That's not going to be good. Okay, good. At least that one's turning to the to the right, which means as long as I keep going this way, I should be fine. I should be okay, theoretically. Talk about messed up, though. I mean, for real. Uh-oh. <laughs> that one was just straight up killed by the... By the fire meteor. <laughs> for once, I'm... For once, I'm grateful for hot burning rocks. 
Uh-oh, that's not good. Darn. Can I make it? I honestly can't tell. That's why I'm doing that. Probably shouldn't be, but, you know, that's just what's going to happen, right? Let's see. I got to turn. I got to turn AS ASAP. If I'm going to avoid a head-on collision. Come on, hurry up. Actually, I should turn and then stop. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Okay, now stop. Because there's another one coming this way. And it'd be a shame to have a head-on collision after I just avoided one, you know? Actually, I should follow him. It'll cause, the, it'll cause more ice to melt, but I think you only need one. And as long as I can avoid dying, that'll be a worthy investment, right? I mean, I should say so. Hey, buddy, hope you don't mind if I hitch a ride with you. There was no way you were going to let me go down the other way, right? In fact, I might just end up with over ten of them by the time I get there. So, you know, over half. It's not bad. Not that these hearts are doing me any good because I'm already full. Ah, there we go. Don't turn with them. Thanks, buddy. See you later. You know, your dark trains aren't so bad. Once you, once you figure out their pattern, they're not so bad. They just want to be left alone. Kind of like me. It's the armor trains that are the real bad guys because they follow you. The dark trains, yeah, they're just chilling. They're just going their own way. They don't want to crash. They just want you to leave them alone. I mean, that, that seems, pretty, seems pretty reasonable to me, right? Okay, I got 13. That's not bad. Not too bad. I might get down with 12 if I'm really unlucky. Okay, come on. Break it up, baby. Bingo. Bingo, baby. There should be more than enough ice to get rid of every last bit. Whew, looks like we made it somehow. Why are we doing such... No, no, that's not Princess like to say. Come on, let's find Kakurin and tell him about the ice, Link. Let me guess. I know you're about to say. Why do we have to do such BS for these Gorns? For these stupid rock people. I'm sorry. Is that your train? It's looking good. Even we Gorons cannot defeat the lava. I'm afraid we are not much use. Use the ice. For crying out loud, use the ice on my train. I wonder what he meant by something cold. I've never seen anything like that before. You're just going to wait around for all the ice to melt, aren't you? I guess I got to go find that... That chief... Chagorin? I, for, I forgot what his name is. You know, the important guy. This guy. This guy right here. What is it, young stranger? I have it. Oh, wonderful. We can use it to chill the lava that is separating us from the village. Come on, everybody. Come help me move this off the train. Choo-choo, baby. Oh. I see the... The lava that is covering the one on the, the upper right is still very much an issue. Thank you. Now you should go meet the elder. His house is at the most northern part of the village. Ah, so the one that's slightly to the left? Because that is the most northern. And it looks a lot different on the map, too. That's probably another big sign. I mean, if I'm being honest. You better not make me do another trivia. Because I'm pretty sure me... Helping you is proof of my loyalties or something. Mm, who are you? The Elder certainly is imposing, isn't he? If we want him to help us, we'd better make a good impression. Gramps, Gramps! Sure, that's a good impression. Oh, my grandchild, are you alright? We were all so worried about you. This boy fixed the path to the village, Gramps. That is how I can make it back home. Is that so? That's a good impression. Oh, so you're the human Kagoran spoke of. I am the elder of this village. Thank you for your help. Now you are like a Goron to us all. Well, cool. I have heard why you want to see me. You want the secret that has been entrusted only to go the Gorn elders, right? 
Well, on this special occasion, I will allow you to pass. Thanks. No one has been this way in a while, so be careful. Awesome. I'm guessing this is some kind of perilous path that I must go down. Yep. Ow. Okay, forget this. Let me blow you away. Or at least get rid of your fire. It seems to work like a, some kind of barrier. Uh, whoops. Come on, man. Link, learn how to aim with that thing, huh? Although I shouldn't talk. I'm the one who's aiming you. Did not mean to do that. Oh, uh, here we go. Come on. Man. Okay, I guess I can't get that one. Forget about it. Huh. Yeah. That's real smart, ain't it? Just fall straight in. I'm sure that'll solve everything. You got the demon fossil. It's like a normal fossil, but more demon. Also more valuable. Here at Aperture Science, we have demon fossils. That's 60% more demon per fossil. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I could just use the whip to get back, but hey, whatever helps. Link, why did you just assume that you must jump off the bridge? I mean, you were on the bridge, and then you decided to not be on the bridge. I know you were teetering on the edge, but... Really? Really? Well, at least it didn't steal my shield, so, I mean, is I guess I should just thank heaven for small favors, right? You have got to be kidding me. Screw this. You are a terrible person. Has anyone ever told you that? You got a star fragment. Good for that. Unfortunately, my time is coming to an end. So I'm gonna have to say that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like like likes. Also, B larva. What it's doing in a random pod, I have no idea. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one. And try not to have your stuff get swiped by these freaks. Okay, see you later. That monster... Of course it did. Of course it freaking did. That's the last one, and it ate my shield right as I was destroying it. Forget it, see you later. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.